right, so we're just arriving here now. Just come through Can Pater and just about to pull into our little road. Turning into it now, Tracy. Here we go. Last time we were here, it was very wet. Just wanted to show a record of uh, what's it like here living in France and uh, what I've been up to. Um, what we have to do is do a lot of gardening and as you've seen in previous videos of living the dream and this is living the dream in beautiful France is the fact that um, there's some gardening after a storm. Now, we had a storm a few weeks ago and it, the weight of the snow was pressing down on a lot of branches. More of the branches that were Cut down, I piled them on a pile here, ready to take across to the tip. So I've got to move all that now. Just uh, working through all of the little chores. Get rid of clean the fire out now, get rid of the ash. And the last time that we were here. Uh, I'm just better go for a walk in a second and uh, get a walk in, so it'll be half an hour walk. Day one in the south of France. I'm here on my own this uh, next couple of weeks, uh, from the 1st to the 15th of March 2020. Do lots of exercise, do some gardening, and uh, certainly clear up the garden because we had quite a heavy storm last time uh, Trace and I were here. Um, we'll do some cycling, do some lovely hill walking, um, lots of exercise, um, eating relatively healthy. I've got some nice uh, salads and some tuna and some fish, and I'll be having that over the next two weeks. And catch up on some box sets and also to um, I'm going to do some editing, I'm going to finish off the Iceland video and to uh, work on the New Zealand trip that we had uh, a couple of years ago, Tracy and I and I'm going to be editing that and uh, hopefully have that finished um, in two weeks time. First day here in France and I'm out on my Making the most of it. walk. So day 8, day 10, day 11, out for my walk again. I said to Tracy I wasn't going for a walk tonight but I felt I need to do one last thing because I still had half an hour before normal nightfall. So, day 11, another walk with my beard. How long will it last? Hi, in day 3 and my favourite hill, the Corsivy Hill, which is 3 kilometres up. And uh, I always like to come here and place a stone. And I have another stone to represent the many times I come up here on my cycle ride. Day 4 of our little trip here in South of France and using the Osmo Pocket entirely today just using the, uh, the lens that's fitted to the Osmo Pocket and um, tomorrow on the cycle ride I will use the new Freewell Osmo wide angle lens and this is an arm's length and just to see what it's like and we're going to go for a hill ride on uh, my bike and um, here we go now at the stone placement stopping point where I place all my pebbles or stones to signify how many times I cut this hill. Need. What we do, we find a convenient stone that's relatively not too big. Too big, too small, just right. Big enough and flat enough to stay in position. So we're day four now here in France on my self-isolation two weeks because the uh, little coronavirus is on at this present time and it's increasing in the UK up to 51 today so uh, hopefully it's safe and sound here in France but I uh, wonder what it'll be like when I get back in a week and a half's time so it's onwards and upwards up the mountain to Corsovay next stop The 
course of it. Here it is. Just had a flight on the uh, DGI Mavic Air um, here at the top of Corsavi. Got to fly around the park. So I must head off now and just have some water and a little bit of my snack bar and then how head from Mont Ferra from Corsavi along the top and then down the hill and back home. So that was a good cycle ride and a uh, good two and a half hours out. Uh, the course of a so just thought I'd stop here a very famous viewpoint overlooking our little place in France so we're we'll using the Osmo pocket on this little cycle trip and we're going to be trying out one of these the new free well wide angle Osmo pocket lens wide angle lens We're at arm's length now and we're filming with the Freewell wide angle lens. After our long cycle ride today, it's maybe a little bit wider and a bit better for things like vlogging now, like this. I'm glad to be home. Oh, it's just started to rain. So there we go, had a lovely cycle ride today and uh, puffed out. I need some hot soup now to warm up. Oh, we'll walk down the river. I haven't been down the river yet. Let's go and see, because last time we were here, that river was flowing really bad. Really glad or bad. Going down to the first river dry bed. It'll all get overgrown. Oh my goodness. Oh, this. Wow. It's unovergrown again. It's now clear again. Just really. The river came down here. Very tall tree. But all its roots are on show. All the rocks embedded in the roots. You can't see it surviving, but it's got so many rocks. Basically, a wall of rock. Hope you enjoyed the little video of some of the surroundings here in South of France. <laughs>